Hello and welcome to Zabbix Handy Tips. Today we'll learn how to deploy and configure a Zabbix proxy node with an SQLite database backend for distributed monitoring. First, let's connect to the terminal of our proxy node and install the proxy. To do this, we have to install the Zabbix repository. Once the repository has been installed, we can install the Zabbix proxy package with SQLite database backend. Once the installation has finished, we need to locate the Zabbix proxy configuration file and configure the proxy. By default, the Zabbix proxy configuration file is located in etc slash Zabbix slash Zabbix proxy.com. We have to use the server parameter to specify the address or the DNS name of our Zabbix server. We also have to provide an arbitrary hostname for our proxy in the hostname parameter. Lastly, in the DB name parameter, we have to provide the location where we will store our Zabbix proxy SQLite database file. Once all of the necessary parameters have been configured, save the changes. Now we can enable and start our Zabbix proxy. Let's add the Zabbix proxy in our Zabbix frontend. Navigate to Administration, Proxies, and press the Create Proxy button. Here we have to provide the proxy name that we used in the hostname parameter in the proxy configuration file. Press the Add button to add the Zabbix proxy. For this example, our Zabbix proxy will collect information from a Zabbix agent deployed on a host. Connect to the host that your proxy will be collecting the metrics from. Find the Zabbix agent configuration file and look for the server parameter. For our passive Zabbix agent checks to work, we have to update the server parameter and add the Zabbix proxy address or DNS name so our proxy is permitted to communicate with this particular Zabbix agent host. Save the changes and restart the Zabbix agent to apply them. Next, let's configure our host to be monitored by our newly deployed Zabbix proxy. Navigate to Configuration Hosts and find the host that you wish to monitor by the Zabbix proxy. Click on the host name and in the Monitored by Proxy field, select your Zabbix proxy node. Press the Update button to apply the changes. Let's wait for the proxy to obtain the configuration changes. Once the Zabbix proxy has obtained the new configuration changes, we can navigate to Monitoring, Latest Data, Find our host and we should see that our metrics are being successfully collected by our newly deployed proxy and the Zabbix server has received them for problem detection and long-term storage.